Hello, Hearts of Iron fans. You want something more in depth than the base game. You want something that's a bit more historical. Well, and you wanting to, to try out Black Ice, a, a mod that I play a lot for uh, Hearts of Iron um, 4. Uh, so, how to install it? I know it's fairly simple for most people, but just had a question about this um, asked and had a few others in the past. So I decided I'm going to make a video showing how to do it. But first, this, of course, is Gamer1745. And if you're new around here, I hope you will subscribe for more videos on Hearts of Iron, um, Black Ice, and others. Um, and everyone, I hope this earns um, you hitting that like button if it's all helpful or you think it might be helpful to other people out there if you would do that. And hey, if you have a question as well, please post it below. You can just say hi if you like. It helps the algorithm. All right. So you want to install, you want to make sure you get it right, Black Ice for Hearts of Iron 4. This is how you do it. Okay. You go in, obviously, Steam here. You get to Hearts of Iron. You come to the workshop here. This is really simple, but, and um, one of the questions was, you know, what directory do I install it? Now there is, and I do owe somebody another uh, how to how to how to install Black Ice so it doesn't get updated because they updated it recently on me without any warning. So my saved game is um, and there will be I guess another video on that because we get too long if I do that. I'm trying to keep this short. So um, so what you do for this is you come to um, the workshop now this will have all kinds of mods based on popularity and search i'm not going to go through all of that right now i'm just going to come to here now you're going to need to do that but i'm just going to come to my subscribed uh, uh, items here and this is what i want to show you you need these two mods black ice historical immersion mod and black ice um, event graphics there is a um peak max size for mods and with all the graphics added to the game it makes it one one mod um, too large you can play this without this i think but you want this this just adds more graphics there is another version of black ice out there that is the test version uh, that gets updated a lot. So if you want to play the the most recent version that they're testing out, you can play this. This this version normally lasts oh four to six months before it is updated. Um, so um, you want to subscribe to both of these. Okay, so you just you you find the the mod and then you you make sure you can subscribe and unsubscribe. You want to make sure that you're subscribed to both of these mods. Then you want to start Hearts of Iron or here like this. Okay. Then you want to come to um, this here play set. Click on this. Add new play set. We'll just call it T. -T new. Test new. Okay. You want to come here and it's empty because you just created a new thing. So now you want to find the mods and here they are. You want to, and you want to just do this and do this. Okay. There might be other sub mods out there. Um, do that at your own risk, uh, for it. Most, unless they are specifically a, um, uh, sub mod designed for black ice it will probably not guaranteed but probably break your game so um unless it's a specifically sub mod designed for black ice i would not install it so add these two to your playlist okay so now you have that test here good um these are both enabled you can come back here to home and then just you can have more than one here look and then you would select this and now you just hit play and you'll load into black ice you should these current versions and this should be for everything going forward it should be this simple 
to um, install because it will download. Obviously, it didn't need to because I've already have these downloaded. It'll install B25s there, um, but it'll install the mods, and it's all that simple to do to install black ice and you want those two versions of it and you should see you know things like you know black ice arms against tyranny logos as opposed to other logos here so that's how you do it um hope this is helpful again um hit that like button ask questions subscribe hopefully this will help the few people who um are maybe overthinking things but want to make sure that it gets done so thanks everyone